Well, here's Tom Brady. Second and four to Julian Edelman. Just kind of throws it in there, and it's first down at the 47 now. Why don't you say we give Edelman another try here? Might as well. He hit 10 different receivers during the day. Well, that's another 19-yard pickup. Third and goal. Uh, Edelman? Got him. Yep. Why not? Patriots trail 26-21. Edelman's only touchdown. Rob Chudzinski knew something was going to be coming. Mm-hmm. Well, first we flash back to the 1994 AFC wild card game. It's the Patriots and the Browns. This was the last time that the Patriots recovered an onside kick. Ironically, Bill Belichick was the coach of the Browns at the time. So that was 94? Yeah, yeah was I was there. That was just to see who was going to get beat by us in 94. <laughs> 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 get there to get yeah, beat. Get there to who's going to get beat down. <laughs> so Gaskowski lines it up, but this is how you're supposed to do an onside kick. That's good. That was perfect. This well, goes executed. exactly 10 yards, right? Yeah. Can we can we see that again? Well, it did. Yeah, yeah. everybody well, go. Actually, he you touched hit. it before he got 10. He had to make a decision. Go yeah. get it or get hit. It was right at 10 yards. I think it bounced back. Kyle Arrington recovers it, by the way. So the Patriots. The kicker was kind of guarding the ball, was mm-hmm. keeping guys out of the way. And you guys say kickers don't do anything. Patriots ball at the 30. Brady to Josh Boyce in the end zone, but it's incomplete. There's a flag on the play. That that is, this is a tough call, wasn't that it? That is a suspect. You could call it, but it's really not pass interference. He did have his hands on his back, and he's reaching. See, so he grabbed him right there. You could call it, but you got to let him play because that's going to change the game right there. Well, They've been on the wrong end of those calls the last couple of times. So. And that's exactly what it does. First and goal at the one. Pick play. They've been doing this pick Brady play. Brady and Danny Amendola years. for the touchdown. The Patriots would fail on the two-point conversion, so it's a 27-26 lead for the Pats. Now here's Jason Campbell desperately trying to march him down the field. Got to be able to finish. Hits Jordan Great Cameron throw, for 13 yards. You got to pay Campbell. Get up to that line. Get up to that line. You got to spike it quickly before you run out of time. Campbell's a veteran. He knows what to do. So there's one second left on the clock. Billy Cundiff from 58 yards out in cold weather. This is not an easy kick. It's a long way. I thought it was good for a minute. We saw a 64 yard in the day. That's a good point. He had a shot. Patriots come back again to win. He led Harvard to a 10 0 season last year. Fitzpatrick down 27 17. Two and a half minutes to go. Tommy, this is his first snap he's ever taken. Looks like he's been around. You know, a guy who you know doesn't get very many reps, but very comfortable. He slides in the pocket right there. Great pass. On fourth and six, down by 10, he hits Isaac Bruce for 43 yards. So, the good hands team for Houston on the field. Bad news for Texans. They don't have 11 of them. And it goes out of their hands and into the hands of Torrey Holt. And so the Rams have scored. They get the onside kick. And Fitzpatrick goes back to Holt from Havid to Holt for 19 yards. And then, wouldn't you know it, nine seconds to go. As the Swamp predicted, Jeff Wilkins <laughs> with the field goal up. And good. And the Red Houston had this game won eight times over. Now we go to overtime, tied at 27 all. Houston has the ball, they actually drove, but naturally, Carr is sacked by a Tugway, and so they have to get rid of the ball. Now, Fitzpatrick comes in, sacked for almost the safety, but on third and nine, look it up. He's throwing Smooth. like he's been in the league. Smooth. That's the pass to hold by 11, and that's the swing over to Kevin Curtis, who's been involved in so many big plays, and he could go all the way. Oh my goodness gracious, the Rams trailing 24 to 3 at the half ra- rally with a guy that's never taken a snap in the NFL before, Ryan Fitzpatrick. He throws for 300. It's a great story. Yeah. Now a field goal. Pittsburgh makes it 23 13. Through two and a half to go, but McNabb to Brian Mitchell. Mitchell, 13 yard touchdown, 23 20. Yeah, and boy, has he made up for the absence of Deuce Staley in a lot of ways. Now, watch this. Everyone in the park knows it's an onside kick. Gerard Cherry falls on it for Philadelphia, but wait, it went nine and a half yards. So they did all the work. They're going to have to try it again. So certainly Pittsburgh's going to get this one, right? No! Two onside kicks in a row recovered by Philadelphia. Tim Hout falls on it for Andy Reid's Eagles. Six seconds to go. David Green Acres. Da 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 da. 39 yards. Good. Tied at 23. We go to overtime. Eagles win the toss. First possession. McNabb to Pritchett. This time he waits deep until the midnight hour. 
and in field goal range is David Akers. Da -da 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 it's good. 26-23. Philadelphia down 10 with under three minutes to go. They win it. Methodically moving down the field, Romo to Jason Witten. Witten had 100 yards receiving, and now he dumps it off to Marion Barber for 10 yards. So the Cowboys, they know they need a touchdown on a two-point conversion, and here's Romo to and Creighton. That, and that's the Romo we're accustomed to seeing, a guy driving his team down the football field for a touchdown. Two-point conversion, Owens goes up, but Jabari Greer rips it away. So it looks like the Bills have the victory locked up 24-20. The Cowboys stunned, but they obviously try the onside kick. The ball's back, and Nathan up, Jones up. falls on it. That's a great play by Nathan Jones. What an effort to get that ball. My Cowboys with no timeouts. Romo steps up in the pocket. Looks like he hits T.O., but they wanted to take a second look at it, and the play was overturned because, as you can see here, the ball comes out and hits the ground, so the Cowboys still with no timeouts left. Theo's got to make that catch in that type of situation. So they're at the Bills 47 yard line. 10 seconds, Romo dumps it off to Marion Barber. And he'll pick up another eight yards for good measure to Patrick Creighton who gets out of bounds. And now it's Nick Folk, the rookie out of Arizona from 53 yards away, game over. But hold on, Bills head coach Dick Jerron called timeout, pulled the lane Kiffin and a Mike Shanahan. He called timeout right before the snap, so we'll do it again. The rookie from Arizona had never made a kick from 53 yards until just then. No problem. Oh, knocks it down, and the Bills, they lose 25 to 24. T.O., Jerry Jones and company, they can't believe it. Michael Irvin up there in the booth. The Cowboys win it 25 to 24. Four receivers set for Cleveland. Couch steps up. Guns it to the end zone. Caught by Davis. Touchdown, Cleveland. Second of the day for the rookie, Andre Davis. Three linebackers on that front line for Tennessee. It's a timing kick. Dawson, did Cleveland get it? Whoa, he got it. Oh, what a play by Northcutt. To get down the field. and watch the bite. It just bounces up perfect for Northcutt. Couch out of the shotgun on a third and six. Rush is coming. Couch throws. Dennis Northcutt breaks the tackle and takes it in for the touchdown. We'll snap it for Cleveland. Dawson on the approach. Dawson leans into it and bangs it through. Browns win it and they rally to do so. Today, just seven points to show for it on the board. Second and five. Again, touchdown. Marty Booker. get a bounce oh there's a high hop it is a pile up inside midfield let's see who comes up with the football bears ball bears are out of timeouts you gotta take your time steps up gonna go for it all in the end zone jump ball Up now for Cleveland. Couch out of the shotgun. Throws. That's batted into the air. Intercepted, and the Bears are going to win it. Mike Brown has done it again. Had to leave the game. High ankle sprain, right ankle, but they think he'll play next Monday night. Meanwhile, if I only had circus catches by Isaac Cruz. <laughs> Touchdown! What a play by Bruce. 24 21, Rams within three. And three minutes to go. Onside kick. Dre Bly on it for the Rams. Put your helmet on. Oh, he ran off the field. No flag. If I only threw it on the seam. To hold first down. Help me out here, Tom. I'm losing my. It's down to the. If I only had the winning score. Bruce, touchdown. Bolger, unbelievable. Marty, can't believe it. But San Diego's not done. Drew Brees, Jerusha Caldwell on fourth and 12, keeps the drive alive. 20 seconds. Do the Bolts have a miracle? No. Dexter McLeon with the pick. 
the 0-5 Rams are now 4-5. Quarterback.